I got a super cool new accessory that I want to show you. And this is something that I had talked about in some of my videos a while ago when I was looking at mini flow and mini Samba bags. And that was that I wasn't crazy about the mini flow strap because it's a little too short for me and it's very thin. So um, sometimes it really cuts into my shoulder. And then you know the mini Samba doesn't come with the long strap. So I was using a strap from another bag when I used that one. And somebody suggested to me that I should look at Patricia Nash straps. And I finally did. And Macy's was having a great sale on Patricia Nash stuff. So I grabbed one of her straps and I love it. And it really solves a lot of my problems. So I wanted to share it with you guys today. So here's the strap I got. And it is a floral design. And you can see the floral design goes the whole length of the strap. And then on the ends, it is stamped with, I guess this is like Patricia Nash's logo or trademark. It's on a lot of her stuff. It almost looks like a dogwood flower if I had to kind of figure out what it is here. And then you can see on the other side, you can see the stitching here. And then the hardware is like a brushed gold-ish color. And the underside of the strap is super soft suede. So it's very comfortable and the strap is adjustable. So you can make it shorter all the way down to the end and that makes it like a long drop shoulder bag. And you can't really make it a short drop shoulder bag. So this is really for me gonna be used for crossbody wear. And I got this super colorful one because you guys know I have all these really colorful bags and I thought this would match most of them. I think the only thing it probably won't go with is black. And I think I only have one black bag, so that's okay with me. So I wanted to try it on a couple bags for you guys today and show you what it looks like. So the first bag I'm gonna put it on is my turquoise mini Samba. And what I'm gonna do is just clip it onto the rings on either side, like this. And you can see this hardware doesn't match. So this hardware really looks better on the Florentine bags than it does on the Sambas, because the Samba has that really shiny hardware. So it doesn't quite match, but that doesn't bother me so much because we all know I'm not that good at matching. So let me put this on for you guys. And you can see what it looks like. Let's see. So you can see this is nice and thick, comfortable on the shoulder. This can go even lower, so I don't have it adjusted all the way down. It can go even lower than this on the hip, which I really like. When I'm carrying my bags crossbody style, I really like them to be low on the hip so I can reach in easily. So you can see, it's really cute. I love it with this color. It doesn't match, but it goes together somehow. So that's what it looks like on the mini Samba. So now, let me get out a mini flow to show you guys. Let's see, here it is. I pulled out my mini Violet, and I'm just going to Put the strap here on the ends where I would normally clip the strap that comes with the bag. And you can see this hardware matches much better. So it's still not an exact match, but it's pretty close. And then I will show you guys what this looks like with a mini flow. So. really cute and hangs much better much more comfortable on the shoulder and hangs down lower which I like a lot the mini flow strap that it hangs up here on me and it just feels like a really awkward spot I really want it to truly be on my hip so that's what it looks like with a mini flow so I pulled out one more bag to show you guys, and that is a small Samba. Now, 
I was going to pull out a small flow too, but I thought it might be a little bit redundant. I just want to show you what it looks like with a different size bag. So I pulled out my emerald Samba bag. So you can get an idea of a different color with this strap and whether or not you think it looks good. And I'm just going to clip that on the ends where the other strap that comes with the bag normally goes. I'm going to make this a little bit longer because I think. And the one thing that I don't like about this strap is it is adjustable, but it's tough to adjust. Like you really got to get in there and use your muscles. So. Let me show you what that looks like. So here it is with a small size bag. Looks great with the green, it really pops out. Some of the green in the floral design. And once again, it feels super, super comfortable. Way more comfortable than the strap that comes with the bag. So, so far, and I've only had this strap for a week or so now and I've used it I don't know five or six times but I really like it and she has tons of other designs so if colorful isn't your thing there's plain brown there's plain black there's studded there's um, leather like piecework almost like quilted quilt design leather she has like every different kind of strap that you could ever want to go in a bag so if you're looking for a super comfortable strap go check it out and when I got mine on a really great sale on Macy's website, I got this for just under $40 shipped. So it was a little bit on the pricey side compared to a lot of the cotton straps I was looking at, but I think it's totally worth it. And I'm a big fan of this and I definitely want to get another one. So I hope you guys go check it out. Thank you guys for watching today. And let me know if you have any comments or questions. Please subscribe if you haven't. I love hanging out with you guys. And uh, I will see you next time.